What it do, beautiful people? Your girl, Poet Time for your Just Curious Report. First and foremost, happy birthday, Barack Obama. Maybe one day I will live in a country where everybody is entitled to basic health care and people don't fight the system and chop people hours for something as stupid as somebody being able to go to the doctor when they're sick. But that is another blog for another day. Let's talk about Philly Rod receiver Riley Cooper, who's in trouble because that video popped up of him at a country concert where he's basically saying he would fight all the niggers in the building. He since apologized. It's going to be interesting to see if he's still a starter this football season, but don't apologize for how you really feel if you don't like black people then it just is what it is d wade has been ordered by a judge to surrender his children to his ex-wife apparently you can't keep your kids away from their mom just because you have full custody and you think she's crazy so the bieber was attacked at a concert anytime your fans start throwing crap on stage you know that you're doing a crappy job beep don't believe me ask rihanna Simon Kyle expecting a baby by his homeboy's wife who's in the middle of a divorce. Now imagine that and how awkward Christmas will be this season when you have to explain how daddy's best friend is also the uncle of the baby that I have with his ex-wife. Very confusing. That's all alleged, of course, but Simon Cowell has been known to do some dirty dog deeds. So MasterChef finalist, what's his name, Josh Marley, 7226, apparently in Chicago, got crunk and violent and told people that he was God while he was attacking cops and whatnot. I can't with what's in the water in Chicago, but I really wish somebody would investigate that. Stop fighting Obamacare and let's fight whatever is in the water in Chicago. But that is another blog for another day. Angela Simmons is the latest celebrity to uh, get you rushed to the hospital because of exhaustion. I'm not mad. It is what it is. Stevie J tweeted, he's, he's indeed married, but I think we knew that because you and Jocelyn have been rocking wedding rings since y'all came back from Puerto Rico. We're not stupid. So, Keisha Cole tweeting that BT ain't paid her for the first season of Keisha and Booby. Not probably the best way to get your money, but I understand that a chick need her Skrilla since you ain't got no album out. In other Booby and Keisha news, it turns out that the Booby beatdown that took place at the Essence Music Fest was all about some dude telling Booby that, well, he smashed the homie, as in, I screwed your wife. Which could make some people upset. I understand that. Shout out to Lisa Ray, who's decided at the tender age of 46 to be celibate. I agree with that, because sex complicate things. If you don't believe me... Just ask some of your friends who come complaining to you after they've done the deal. Nicki Minaj is adding a little extra leg to the rumor that Drake and Wheezy are beefing. She says that she owes everything to Young Money because of her career and you can't help what happens to people once they become famous and certain people are in their ears. You know, it's been rumored for the longest time that Drake is unhappy at Young Money. He feels like he gives them too much money, although he's the one making all the money. Lord knows there's a bunch of people sitting on the bench. We ain't heard from yet. Shout out to Floyd Mayweather, who knows how to break up with a woman. Classy. Him and his fiance have called it quits. Apparently, she was flirting with Akon and a couple other people at a party recently. He's now selling all her stuff that he bought her as gifts on eBay. Yes, I have logged on. Yes, I am so bitten on a Birkin and a pair of shoes. Why? Because, hmm, when am I going to afford that? I'm just saying. Oprah wants you to know that if you use the N-word, don't use it around her. If you are a friend, she thinks the word should have been not used. And I... Like that. Go ahead, Oprah. I wonder if she said that to Jay-Z when they were walking through Brooklyn, though, that you can't use the N-word when you're rolling with me and hanging out with me. Shout out to Simon Kyle, who is expecting his first baby by his best friend's wife. Yeah. Andrew Silverman is in the middle of divorce with some chick named Lauren, who's a socialite. Apparently, her and Simon hooked up, if you believe the rumors, and well... He has a baby on the way. If you also want to hear a great rumor, it's all about Nick Cannon being jealous of Arsenio Hall hanging out with Mariah Carey too much as they prepare for the launch of his talk show. I won't even get into that and dignify that with anything. I'll just say that I think that is hilarious. I'm your girl, Poet. That's officially your Just Curious Report. Find all my reports at hiphopmatrixshow.com. Get all the information that you need to be talking about, some things you don't know, like the chick that got four years because her kids snorted cocaine and she didn't take them to the hospital, at poetaylor.com, Poe Chains on Instagram, Overly Poet on Twitter, and of course, right here, you're just curious to report, youtube.com, baby. Love you. Mwah.